there's a little tip. Um, if you're cutting something that's butting up against something flat, say that was level, put a bit of an angle in it. Because if you have to do any fine adjustment, it's a lot easier just to take some of the meat out the top of this than it is after to do the whole thing, if you know what I mean. So if I've got to take, say, I don't know, half a minute out of that, all I've got to do is deal with this little bit here rather than the whole lot. And if you're expecting a lot of adjustment, just increase this angle a bit so it leaves a thin bit at the top. Just makes life a little bit easier. Today's little project, window boards. We want a 50 mil overhang on this and 50 mil sticking out or proud of the wall. So I've marked that, given us a line, that's gonna be our line where the wall is gonna end, but obviously this bit's gonna be sticking out. So what I need to know is how level this wall is. So if I pop this up here, and then measure there, that's 233, 238. So, so five, there's a 5mm difference. So obviously this wall's either not square or that window's not square. I'm guessing it's probably the wall. However, we're gonna chop the back of this off. So from this line back, I want five, my 233 plus my 50 mil, give us 283 and then 288 on that side. And I'm going to be cutting it a little bit wonky. And I can trim the back of this out and then we can find this angle and cut that out. What we've got, I've marked my line, 288 this side, 283 this side. Also, using one of these, um, that, that's practically 90 degrees, so that's all right. But this side, not so much. Um, it's just the reality of it, you know, new builds and what, what have you. So, starting at my 50 mil in from here, I've made a mark there, which gives me my angle. So hopefully now, if I cut this off, and cut that back out. This should then slot straight in first time. Just like that. Yeah, we'll see. I know it's not perfect, but laughing that is worth it, even when it's hurting. And you feel uncertain, and you feel like, feel like, who is that person? Every time you try to make it better, nothing seems to be working Why is it so hard? Strongest in the room, no one ever asks how she doing Cause everyone around her just assuming That she's always fine, but in the meantime she feels ruined but nobody knows that she's falling down Falling down, falling down I can't get up Reach off with that Obviously we've got some decorators cork just going around there. Standard. But no, pretty good fit. Sits in nice, it's nice and steady. Um, just take a little bit of extra time doing your marking out and there we go. The system works. Right, this next one is only about three mil difference in the back line, but the sides, as you can see, like that's the 90, this one's about five mil off, but this side, by the time you get to the back, this is almost a 13 mil difference. Um, it is what it is, isn't it? You know, that's why we get the angle. All right, that's in. I've got three fixings I'm gonna see, and there's some silicon underneath the front edge as well. And it's got quite a deep countersink, so you've got to get room for filler to go in there. Next thing is to fill these holes. I like to use a two pack stuff. A bit like, it's a bit like mixing car body filler. Um, it works really well and it goes off really quick. So I should be able to get a couple of coats on this before I go home. It should be ready for painting.
There's this one. Find it getting out. Right. I like to use the lid. Plastic, it's reusable. And the tiniest dot of this really seems to do the trick. If you give it too much, it'll go off too quick. And then become a real pain. the same for the other two and then with any luck by the time I've done the last one this one will be set for sanding yeah. it even smells like car filler so if you like car filler or the smell of it body filler this is the stuff for you Make sure there's no dust in here. Yeah, it's going to take two goes of that. Oh, really feels a bit sticky. Be shy to do it in a couple of goes. Um, there's a little bit too much of everything's got to be done in one go now. There we have it. Alright, it's been about 10 minutes, I suppose. Give this a little sand. <laughs> Some fine filler in that. And there, and there. A little bit more sand in, but that's basically window boards. Measure twice, cut once. Um, yeah, and then when this is done, I'll put some decorators corking around the edge of it. There we have it. Sanded the screw holes down. I'll give it a light sand just before I paint them but that's window boards alright strongest in the room no one ever asks how she doing cause everyone around her just assuming that she's always fine but in the meantime